Hello, all you lords, ladies, and non-binary nobility. Welcome to Kelvin Scoring TV. We're playing Heroes of Might and Magic 2, doing what we like to call death matches. And in this episode, pretty much every death match was requested by you, the viewer. Uh, this first one was requested um, by Absh in uh, YouTube comments. 5,000 Phoenixes taking on 500 Titans and 500 Black Dragons. Who is your pick? I do wish to enable auto combat. Thank you for asking. Oh! Ho, 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 ho. Oh, it's so hard to watch. Congratulations, you voted for the Phoenix. Of course they won. There were 5,000 of them. You win. Our next death match is requested by Omer Heron in YouTube comments. 400 ghosts versus 250 vampire lords. I came up with the numbers. Some sort of combination of ghosts. Again, some sort of combination of vampire lord. A lot of people have been asking for a matchup like this. All right, whatever a ghost kills becomes a ghost. Vampire lords can regenerate, and they are regenerating. Ghosts cannot keep up with their generation ability. Congrats if you voted for the Vampire Lords. You take this one down pretty handily. Our next death match is requested by Mega Ninja. Five stacks of six Cyclopes each against one stack of 20. I think this is coming from our argument of splitting stacks versus keeping one in the solid stack, but the uh, split stacks have 30. So I don't exactly know what's going on here. They uh, might be accounting for a lot of double hex damage. We'll see. Oh, drop. Wow. There you go. Solid stack wins. They even had to contend with that rope. They got trapped there for a little bit. They still pulled it off. Congratulations, voted for the solid stack. You win. Our next death match was requested by Yartsa in Twitch chat. Here we have a Yartsa class that gets Ghosts versus Red Dragons. 800 Ghosts, 64 Red Dragons. Always difficult to bet against dragons, but I personally did. Let's see if I'm right. Oh my word, it's 64 Red Dragons. I probably should have been more mindful of how powerful dragons are. Ooh. Oh, okay. There you have it, red dragons, take it down. Don't bet against dragons, what are you doing? Why'd you bet against dragons, you idiot? Next death match is requested by K. Cataleo in Twitch chat. We have two and a half million centaurs taking on 250,000 hydras. Hydras are really tough and I really don't like centaurs. <laughs> but who's your money on? All right, trapped him by a boat. There we go. Uh, can't do math. The first round was like 35,000. Oh, well. You're just clustering for the big boys. That's all you're doing. All right, only 100,000 of them left. Oh. Oh, wow. Decimation. All right, let's see if they can keep away from them long enough. Shooting full of arrows, maybe take him down. Those two should have been moving. Oh, they're gonna get you. Don't you worry. All right, there you have it. The Hydras destroy the Centaurs. Congratulations, voted for them, you win. This next death match was a request from 1d8 damage in Twitch chat. It is the spells blind versus lightning bolt. Kilburn's got the blind. Gallant's got the lightning bolt. Identical armies. Let's make sure that uh, auto casting is on. Yes, auto spell casting is on. And now we're going to auto resolve. Here we go. There's the blind. There's the lightning bolt. Who's your pick? Is it the blind spell or is it the lightning bolt spell? Oh, everyone's getting blinded. All right, lightning bolts. Okay, blind has ended on the trolls and brought right back. Spell powers two, uh, knowledge is three, so they have a few more times casting these spells. Maybe one or two more times. Or maybe not, oh, there's the blind. 
Oof. And there's another blind. Double bird lightning bolt in you. Get the spell points. There it is. Dropping the trolls. Oof. Oof. Oh, this is going to be close, right to the end. Now I think our heroes are out of spell points, so... It looks like Lightning Bolt's going to take this one down. Pretty surprising, actually, given how Battlefield control -y the blind spell is. But congratulations, you voted for Lightning Bolt. You're the big winner. Next death match was pressed by Pava Maltz in YouTube comments. Team Slow versus Team Range. We have 250 dwarves, 250 zombies, 100 iron golems, 100 mummies, and 50 ogres, taking on 20 archmagi, 40 greater druids, 80 Grandos, 120 Orc Chiefs, and 200 Centaurs. Who is your pick? As Team Range starts focusing on the Ogres. Yep. Comes the Mummy Shuffle. All oh, these poor Ogres. Getting destroyed. Alright, now the sh focus is shifted to the Zombombs. Here come the Mummies. Oh, they're getting a little too close. They're like, let's focus on these guys. No, nope, back to the zone. Where are you going? Curses before all the Orc Chiefs. Oh boy, this is, a, this is an issue for Team Ranged. Team Slow is closing in. Look at that, they, they're protecting the Arch Magi. That's funny. Oh. Should be the other way around though. Archmagi don't have a melee penalty. They should be the ones protecting the druids. Oh, these mummies are housing people. And I don't mean giving them shelter. Ouch. Alright. Alright, let's get mobile, everybody. They're gonna have a chance. You gotta run, you gotta shoot, you gotta hope that you don't run out of ammo. There you go. <laughs> okay. I am surprised at how much damage Team Range did inflict, but... Once these dudes run out of arrows, it's... It's over. They're not going to outrun the mummies. There you go. Cornered, outnumbered, trapped, and dead. There you have it. Team Slow takes this one down very, very slowly. Our next death match requested by Shadowwide Winslow in YouTube comments. It's the Army of Darkness encounter. It's 2.5 million skeletons against 100,000 rangers, 250,000 veteran pikemen, 75,000 master swordsmen, 60,000 champions, and 30,000 crusaders. I know who I would pick, but it's not up to me. It's up to you. Who is your pick to win? Here come the deadites. I got a bone to pick with you. I'll cut your gizzard out! <laughs> oh, baby! Crusaders deal double damage to undead, remember? Woof. Hmm. Hmm. Too many Crusaders. Too many of everything. Look at this. Oh. They actually might drop the Crusaders. And then they do. So they have a chance. Until they show up. Oh, you know, they're doing tons of damage, actually. Pretty impressive, actually, what the skeletons have been able to accomplish so far. This is what a necromancy skill gets you, right? This is why necromancy is an S-tier skill for me. Look at how much damage they're doing against what should have been an unstoppable knight army. I mean, they're gonna lose, but... My word, did they make it close. Hail to the king, baby. It's the knight troops who win. Congratulations, you voted for them. You get to high-five Bruce Campbell in your dreams tonight. Our next death match is a request from a YouTube commenter named Elbedso, who wanted uh, Team 
tier one shooters going up against tier five shooters. So we have 1,500 halflings and 1,000 centaurs taking on 80 archmagi, 90 war trolls, and 75 power liches. God, I hope this is a close matchup. Let's see who wins. El Benso did not request numbers, so I came up with them. Hopefully they're good. Oh, halflings getting destroyed. Ooh, centaurs are next. Can't drop that stack of Archmage. <laughs> it wasn't close, and I'm devastated. Congratulations, voted for the tier five troops. You win. It's that times two and a half million maniac challenge time, and our contestant today, 115,000 mummies. Now they're not royal mummies, they're just mummies. But who's your pick? Good luck. Thanks for watching. Comes the flying V. Mummies come in. Oh, dropping a stack of Brendan Frazier's. Another one goes down. Anaksunamu. Uh oh. Can't drop any more stacks. It's a bad sign. Usually only 40,000 of them left. Problem. Problem. <laughs> the Nile's not just a river in Egypt. Congratulations for the peasants. You win. That will do it for today's episode of Heroes of Might Magic 2 Death Matches. Thank you all for watching Kelvin's Coin TV. If you'd like to see more episodes, crit that subscribe button. More will hit your feed. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.